fans of A Sister Wives rallied behind Mary Brown amidst criticism for her actions, particularly following the passing of Garrison Brown. While grieving, Mary faced backlash for her approach to mourning, prompting some fans to defend her on social media platforms like Reddit. Supporters emphasized the complexity of grief and urged empathy, noting Mary's past experiences with loss. They also highlighted the unfair scrutiny she faced compared to other family members. Meanwhile, Discovery Plus promoted upcoming episodes of A Sister Wives, sparking curiosity among viewers about the show's future direction. Despite recent challenges and controversies, loyal fans remain invested in the Brown family's journey. Additionally, fans rejoiced as Garrison Brown's beloved cat, Cat Thu, found a new home with his sibling, Logan, and Logan's spouse, Michelle. The heartwarming gesture provided solace amidst the family's grief, demonstrating the enduring bond between siblings and the importance of love and support during difficult times. Welcome to A Creative Night Shows, where the drama unfolds and the stories captivate. Join us as we delve into the intriguing world of A Sister Wives, revealing the untold tales and hidden truths behind the headlines. Fans of Sister Wives stand up for Mary Brown after hatred. Mary Brown is receiving backlash for her decisions, even though the Brown family as a whole is grieving Garrison Brown's passing in their own unique ways. When they notice what is going on, some Sister Wives fans leap to Mary's rescue. Supporters protect Mary Brown from hatred. While it is not fair for anybody to dictate to another how to grieve, it is easy to pass judgment on those who experience loss in a different way than you. One Sister Wives fan comments on Reddit, saying, Mary's latest post doesn't deserve the hate it's getting, then talks about the current problem. Mary uploaded a video, and it's overflowing with people's f asterisk king awful remarks about her. They go on, you are free to laugh because you have experienced intense grief in the past. A therapist would, if anything, recommend it. It's therapeutic to laugh with my pals when we mourn at a loved one's passing. Then they make note of the fact that Mary Brown has experienced loss of close ones before. They also make note of the fact that, despite her assistance in raising Garrison Brown, he is not her biological kid. Others then started to join in on the discussion. Additional fans discuss Mary Brown's handling. Other Sister Wives fans join the discussion on Reddit after Mary Brown's initial post about suffering abuse for moving on with her life was made. Notably, the original poster notes that other family members, such as Christine Brown, are not facing as much criticism for going back to their regular ways. I laughed when I saw that someone had taken it upon themselves to correct her by reminding her of Garrison's mother's name, then promptly misspelled it, the commenter wrote. People are absurd. The most significant one I witnessed was someone telling her she should be in mourning for the remainder of the month. It made me realize that, thank God, we are not living in the Victorian era where we had mourning and were sequestered for a predetermined period of time before being permitted to gradually reintegrate into society over the course of the months. I rolled my eyes, too, because I saw this. The criticism directed at Mary's most recent post by potential underscore focus underscore 4194 in Sister Wives is unwarranted. More supporters claim to be in her defense. Furthermore, there were those who supported Mary Brown. One admirer shared their own experience of various forms of bereavement. All people grieve in unique ways. I cried for two weeks after my dad passed away when I was 11. My 36-year-old son went suddenly a year ago, and I still cry a few times a day for him. I beg of you everyone, please stop. Keep quiet, nobody knows how Mary is feeling. Allow Garrison's family to mourn in peace while he rests in paradise. To Mary and all the Brown family members who are grieving, may you live, laugh, love, and take each day as it comes. This is really crucial. Grief is a complex emotion that varies from person to person and with each loss. Grief is also a dynamic emotion, 
You may laugh one moment recalling something about them and cry the next when you see a chair is empty. There isn't a proper or incorrect way to grieve. Like the rest of the Brown family, Mary Brown is attempting to live, even though no one is certain how she is doing behind closed doors. Her past experiences with death and other material losses may have made her more adept at dealing. Bereavement often comes and goes. It also shows up in a variety of ways during the procedure. Furthermore, it usually never goes away because the individual usually finds new ways to go forward in their own life. What are your thoughts on Mary Brown going back to her life and trying to move on from Garrison? Do you believe Mary posted her happiness on social media too soon? Has the death of a significant person in your life caused you any grief? Are you eager to watch more Sister Wives episodes? Please leave a remark below. Why is Discovery Plus promoting upcoming episodes of A Sister Wives? Recently, viewers have observed that new episodes of the venerable television series Sister Wives are being promoted by Discovery Plus. Fans are curious about what's going on with the show Cycling's promotion. Fans of Sister Wives and Discovery Plus. The Brown family is doing their best to cope with the tragedy, despite having to face their worst nightmare, burying one of their own right now. Following Garrison Brown's passing, numerous fans declared they would not be watching any further episodes. Others, nevertheless, are curious about the family's current situation following the conclusion of Sister Wives Season 18. Unquestionably, it is simple to relate to the characters in a show with such a lengthy run. Moreover, loyal followers have persevered over the years during both good and terrible times. Similarly, despite frustrating occurrences such as the December specials that were supposed to air on Discovery Plus and other channels, viewers of Dyer continue to tune in. Why is Discovery Plus promoting upcoming Sister Wives episodes? Many Sister Wives fans were infuriated when the much-anticipated episodes were not made available on all platforms in December. Some even threatened to terminate their subscriptions due to the issue. Some, nevertheless, persevered despite the chaos. Recently, viewers have become aware of ads for upcoming Sister Wives episodes that are airing on Discovery+. Plus. New episodes every Sunday, is the question raised by a Reddit user in a conversation. The statement, Sister Wives now has a new episodes every Sunday tag again on the Discovery app is followed. Is this a bug, or did I miss something? Other admirers made the following recommendations. Someone responds, the Matrix must be tripping again, in jest. Another critic states, it's been like that for me for about a month, regarding Discovery Plus as a whole. The app has constant glitches. Just as I finished Talk Back Part 2 one week ahead of Part 1. Every Sunday, new episodes? Dreaming of Taco Bay, a BYU from Sister Wives. Future Seasons. After losing a loved one, the Brown family is currently making an effort to go back to something approaching normal. The Sister Wives cast was reportedly filming for season 19, which will air soon. The family was filming, an insider told The Sun, despite Garrison Brown's untimely death. The family is normally always filming, whether it's on their phones or with actual cameras, they explain. Christine Brown also hinted to the continuation of the story following the breakdown of the Polly family. Although TLC has not released an official statement, it appears that a new season is forthcoming. But the ads on Discovery Plus are probably still running from the previous season. Although there aren't any new episodes available on Discovery Plus right now, it appears that the TLC network is working on the upcoming season. On the platform, users can watch previous seasons, though. Do you believe Discovery Plus should run Sunday morning commercials for upcoming Sister Wives episodes? Will you, as a devoted viewer, be keeping up with Sister Wives when it comes back? Please leave a remark below. View the new and adorable home for Garrison Brown's cat. Fans of Sister Wives are aware of Garrison Brown's cat love. 
He had three at the time of his death, Ms. Buttons, Patches O'Hullihan, and Cat Thu. Fans were understandably worried about the kitties after his death. Fortunately, Janelle Brown revealed that they moved in with Garrison's siblings and lived in devoted, caring households. One sibling has since acknowledged that they took in Cat Thu. See who currently owns the gray cat and how he's settling into his new home by reading on. Fans of Sister Wives are thrilled to learn who took in Garrison Brown's cat. Cats were Garrison Brown's favorite animal. A few animal shelters in Flagstaff paid tribute to him in different ways after his passing. One of Garrison's siblings has now attested to the fact that they welcomed Cat Thu. He moved in with Logan, Garrison's older brother, and his spouse Michelle. This week, someone posted something on Reddit, Garrison's cat has a new home. They shared a picture from Michelle's Instagram story, proving that Logan and Michelle had adopted the gray cat. I adore Michelle and Logan, they're truly remarkable. Michelle wrote as the caption for her shot, Cat Thu requires a 10-scratch toll payment before I begin the morning. Cat Thu appears to be adjusting well, despite the fact that any cat might experience stress when moving to a new home and having new owners. The news that Michelle and Logan had taken in Garrison's cat delighted other Redditors. They penned. Aspen and Mitch took in Ms. Buttons, the nine-year-old cat Garrison had recently adopted before he passed away, I read on another Sister Wives site. As I read this, I started crying. One of my greatest dreams is that my family will step up to take care of my fur kids, as I have many cherished animals and have battled depression and health issues. I'm overjoyed that his family members may cherish a small portion of him. I'm so glad to hear that Cat Thu will always be cherished. Aw, I'm glad Cat Thu found a loving home. Logan Brown pays tribute to his junior brother. Sibling loss is never easy. Logan Brown, along with numerous other family members, was devastated to discover of Garrison's demise. Logan is a relatively private person these days, but he did speak out following the family tragedy. I adore you, Gar. I miss you so much, and the world seems less humorous and darker these days. However, the laughs, memories, and love you left behind give me peace. Logan said, I like to imagine you are cruising Fiddler Green in a Bradley that you named Cat Daddy, with a Roman centurion's helmet on, but only from the gunner's seat because you are an absolutely horrible driver. Despite the fact that nothing will ever bring Garrison back, many find solace in the fact that Logan and Michelle adopted Cat Thu. When you heard that Logan and Michelle had taken in Garrison's cat, did you get excited? Post your ideas and opinions in the comments section. To stay up to date on the newest Sister Wives news and developments. Avoid missing out. For more of the latest updates and behind-the-scenes secrets from Sister Wives, make sure to hit subscribe and ring that bell. Stay in the know with every new release.